Hi everyone, Reno Nadiandi here and today I will share you how to create a logo in Affinity Designer 2. So we have an access for 6 months for free to the Affinity Designer and I will make it for redesigning this YouTube channel logo. So this is short graphic body. I want the logo has an image of an, a sea animal and when I search the sea animal that represents body is a dolphin. So I will make a dolphin with S shape and use it as the logo for this channel. So now let's go to Affinity Designer. Continue trial. I'll make a new document here. Page width, I just type 10 and the height also 10. And I will choose DPI 30 and then click create. I'll press a photo of dolphin. Okay, now I will go to this icon, click it and click ellipse tool, press your shift button on your keyboard and then drag it like this. So now you have a circle, click this move tool to move it on your work page and then click this no fill icon and click this one and then click this stroke. I will Increase the size of the stroke to four point. All right. And then go to these layers, click it, and then I will change the name to basic circle. All right. It is necessary to make us not confused when we copy this layer several times. Okay. Now select it and then right click here and then click duplicate and I will rename it as the dolphin so with this circle I will create a dolphin shape okay now click here and then select it and click here and then right click and choose convert to curves Okay, now it is a curve and we can add a node. Just click here. Click on this uh, line of the circle. Click it so it will appear a node. It calls a node and this is the two node to adjust. Okay, I will uh, drag this node to the center like this. And then I will add a node here. I will drag it to here. And then I will click this adjustment and then I will drag it here. Now I will add a node here. I will drag I will drag it here. I will drag it here up here. Alright, and then I will drag this adjustment node here. And then I will drag it here I will move it here all right okay now I will add a node here and drag it to here and I will drag it here I will drag it here and drag it here and then drag this adjustment here all right now I will drag it here and this one should be here. I will make it more uh, smooth by dragging it here. Okay. All right. Now I will move it here. I will add a node here and just drag it here. Now I will add a node here and drag it to the right like this. And then I will drag it here. I will add a node here. Okay. And this one I will drag to here. I will move it here and then adjust it 
All right. And then I will anode, add a node here and drag it to the center and then make it like this and add a node here, drag it here. All right. And I will move it here. Now I will click, right click on this node and then convert to sharp. All right. Then I will drag it here. All right. Let's make, press it back here. And then I will drag it here. I will click here and drag this adjustment here. All right, let's see what can we do with this node. I will move it here. So I think I will uh, move it to the top a little. I saw this one. And then make it like this. Now it's more look like a dolphin. And then I think I should drag it here. And let's see the adjust to adjust here. Okay, I think we should move it back a little. Move it like this and move it here. Okay, so why I use a basic circle on the back? I want to keep the logo on the circle shape. Okay, I think it's uh, enough. And then I will make a fin, this top fin. I will make a three node here. Click here, click here, and click here. And then the center node, I will drag it here. And then this adjustment, I will move it here. All right. I'll click here, and then I will add three node here two, three, to make this side fit. All right, now I will go to the basic circle. I will duplicate it. Okay, and then I will reduce the size. So I will cut this dolphin shape with this uh, oval. I will make it like this and rotate. Okay. Okay, now I will duplicate this dolphin, duplicate, and change the name to Dolphin2. Okay, and uh, the this basic shape, I will change to Basic Circle 2. Okay. Now let's, uh, now let's move the Basic Circle 2 above the dolphin too and then select them both press your shift button and then click here on dolphin too so now we have select these two element and then go to this part choose intersect okay so now we have a so now we have a new shape here okay 
and then I will make a shape like S here. So I need the basic circle and I will duplicate it. Duplicate and I will change it to basic circle 3. And then I will duplicate the dolphin. I will duplicate it and make it dolphin 3. And then I will move this basic circle 3 above the dolphin 3. Now select the basic circle 3. I will reduce the size. And then I will rotate. I will make it like this. I think I should rotate it like this. Okay. And then uh, select with this dolphin. And then click the intersect. Now we have it. Okay. And then I will modify it. Click this node tool and then I will move it here. I will move it here, the adjustment. All right. And then I will drag it here. I will drag it here like this. All right. And I will move it here. And this one here. Okay. So now we have uh, several dolphin here. Dolphin 1, 2, 3. Okay. And also the basic circle. Now let's uh, click this dolphin too. I will go to color and just click here. First click here and then click here. So the color will change. And the dolphin 3, I will change it to... I will make it 3 because I will change the color in Canva. Okay. Just uh, pick it up. Uh, then the dolphin, the first dolphin, I will change to, for example, blue. Alright, now let's select all this dolphin shape, dolphin layers, I mean, and then go to stroke and change the width to zero. Oh, this one is not include. I will make it zero. And then let's check it. If something strange here, we can adjust. Alright, so this is the 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 orange the dolphin tree click the node tool okay and then let's adjust it to cover this adjust it okay and then let's find the other Okay, I think the other is okay. Oh, this one still. I think I should select this blue. And drag it to the center a little. Let's check. Okay, all right. Okay, I will drag it a little to here. All right. Oh, 
Okay, now add, click here and click ellipse tool. Add the eye here. I think the color will be white. Just click here. Okay, so now we have it. And then remove this uh, dolphin. Just delete. We will export it to Canva as SVG. Click File. And then Export. Choose SVG here. In SVG, we can change the color in Canva. And then you can change the raster DVI. I will choose uh, 300. And then just export it. Give it a name. And then click Save. Now go to Canva. Open your folder. And then just drag it here. The Dolphin Short Channel. The SVG. Alright. And then I just search here. Three color palette. I will choose the first here. Okay. And I will move it here first. And then change this blue to this blue. Okay. And then I will change this orange. This orange. I will change to this uh, pink. And I will change this green to this green. Okay. And then let's uh, move it here. And then I will add the text. I will change the font to Lilita 1. And then I will close it and go to effect. I will add a curve effect here. And move it here. Now I will rotate. Let's see the result. I will add the curve. Like this. Rotate. Alright, so now I have it. If you like this tutorial, please like the video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. See you next video and let's run new thing with me.